life on the Red Horse Ranch. <laughs> Now let's visit Red Horse Ranch. The boys are all down in the bunkhouse practicing the tunes that they're going to play at the barn dance to be given in honor of Miss Rose Carter, daughter of the owner of the Red Horse Ranch. Rose has been away at school, and the boys are anxious to show her how glad they are to have her back by playing their very best brand of music at the dance. We join them as they're singing an old favorite of the West. I've been practicing some tunes on my jug. Suppose I ought to take it along to the dance? Your jug? Why, sure. We couldn't put out our best music without your jug, Idaho. Uh, that is, if it's empty. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sure. I wasn't counting on you for nothing but to play on for long. Well, we'd better try another tune if we count on singing our best up there at the dance. <laughs> oh, Arizona, yeah. uh, see who's at the door, will you? Oh, God, sorry. It seems like I've got to do everything. Here, I was just getting started with my set, and I have to get up. Oh, you'd better hightail it on over there to that door before I hand you some of my boots. Oh, George, and I'm going. Oh, well, if it ain't Miss Rose, come right in here, Rose. Oh, I just had to come down to the bunkhouse when I heard you boys singing. <laughs> Are you feeling rested after your nap? Never felt better. Oh, gee, it's grand to be back home. If Dad ever sends me well, away again, I... it ain't much fun I... for us either. When you're gone, your dad's awful hard to get along with. Seems like he gets riled up at the least little thing. Arizona. Oh, don't mind him, Rose. He's plumb loco. <laughs> oh, that's all right. I know. But say, let's have some more music. Well, oh, uh, boys, it sounded grand. What'd you like to hear, Rose? Well, let's see. I've had that dignified for so long. <laughs> I think I'd like to hear something real peppy and noisy. You hear that, Arizona? <laughs> you can make more noise than any coyote I've ever seen. <laughs> uh, grab your banjo there and get busy. Uh, Montana, you help him out, oh, huh? Oh, say, that's just what I wanted to hear. <laughs> Thank you. 
gosh, we was kind of scared you'd be high hatting us after going to that oh. Eastern school back there. Now, Arizona, you should know me better than that. Oh, don't mind him, Rose. I still can't figure out how you <laughs> growed up so much. Why, I know. It seems only yesterday you was just a little toe-headed kid. <laughs> uh, did you like going to college, Rose? Oh, yes, Tenderfoot, of course. But then this is home to me. I guess it always will be. At least I hope so. Yeah, I hope so myself. <laughs> oh, we're all powerful glad of that, Miss Rose. Why, Tex Owens, what are you doing over there in that corner? Come on out here. Well, as long as it's you're asking me, Miss Rose, <laughs> I'll just do that. It's sure nice having you back here with us. Oh, now, Tex, you've got to sing me a song just for that. <laughs> all right, and this one I wrote just in for you, too. Oh, that's nice. We were standing by the garden when I told you of my love You were holding the roses I gave you I'm listening to the cooing dove Roses, roses, red roses bring dreams of you, dear Roses, roses, red roses bring memory of you I can hear I see the road in their glory, they bring sweetest memory of you. The whippoorwill call in the wildwood, mournful signals to its mane. I will meet you too, my darling, in the shadow of the old I never want to leave the West again. We sure hope you don't have to, Rose. Oh, but boys, why don't you tell me the news? <laughs> what kind of a year has it been? Any excitement? <laughs> Dad says there are some new horses. Oh, come on, tell me everything. <laughs> uh, say, Rose, you remember that wild colt that I brought in off the range last fall? Yes, Well, he's I turned did. out to be a beauty. Really? Yeah, and Alabama won't let any of the rest of us have a look at him. <laughs> well. That horse show has brought out the mother instinct in Alabama. <laughs> oh, stop it, fellas. Oh, say, I sure... Oh, wish that you could see that pony, Rose. He's sure a rip snorter. Oh, Alabama, I've just got to see him. Come on and show me. Well, he's down the corral right now. The boys won't mind entertaining themselves till we get back, all so right. what do you say? Oh, we won't mind, not at all. <laughs> but as long as it's the foreman, well, strike up a chord, Arizona. <laughs> Right over there. Oh, Alabama, isn't he a beauty? <laughs> Smart as a fox, and he's got plenty of spirit, too. Wait till he sees me. Let's see if he'll come over here. Oh, Alabama, will you let me ride him? I, uh, well, I don't think that you'd better <laughs> try it, Rose. You're an old granny about that horse, aren't you? <laughs> all right, all right, but I bet I could ride him. You will let me someday, won't you? Well, to tell you the truth, I ain't been on him myself yet. <laughs> oh, oh, look, oh. here he comes. Hello there. Oh, my, you're nice. Mind if I rub your ears? Oh, he doesn't like that. <laughs> <laughs> Come here, Red. Oh, boy. Oh. It's steady there, steady. Uh, meet my best pal, Miss Rose, Red. How do you do? There you are. Oh, isn't that cute? You've taught him to shake hands already. Or would it be shake hooks? Come here, you pretty thing. Oh, please don't run away. <laughs> he don't know anybody but me. <laughs> but I'll tell you a secret, Rose. Huh? Old Alabama knows a good horse when he sees one. Well, I'm not going to argue that. Oh, uh, Alabama. Yes? While we're out here away from the other boys, I want to ask you... Uh, well, what is it? Do you... Well... What's wrong with Dad? Wrong? Mm -hmm. Well, now, I didn't know there was anything wrong, Rose. Well, he, he, he just isn't himself some way. He looks worried, I think. 
Is everything all right here at the ranch, Alabama? Oh, sure it is. Don't worry, nothing's wrong. All right, then. We better get back. Oh, <laughs> all right. The boys are still singing. Mm, I never heard anything so beautiful. It is pretty. What do you think of that guy? Oh, say, he's a hundred percent. And I think you all are mean for joking Alabama about it. Uh, what was that you called him, Alabama? Red? Yeah. Uh, that name strike you all right? Oh, of course it does. Red Horse Ranch and your horse is named Red. Oh, oh say, I think that's a that's good name. Right. Uh, well, I reckon I better start getting him used to it, then. <laughs> that's right. Oh, oh, there's my dad calling me. I'll have to see you boys later. All right. Bye. Gosh. Rose is a swell gal, ain't she? Hasn't changed it a bit. Oh, say, boys, uh, she asked about her dad. She did? Well, what'd you tell her, Alabama? Oh, nothing. I just kind of put her off. No use letting her worry, not till we get this business straightened out. It don't seem like there's nothing we can do about it. Well, I've just been wondering. Oh, but say, if we're riding lines in the morning, we'd better get some chuck inside our belts and hit the bunks early. Oh, what do you yeah. say? Right. Seems there might be some trouble at the Red Horse Ranch. Oh, but let's not worry too much about it. Because the next time we visit the ranch, we'll be attending the Big Barn Dance, and you're all invited. <laughs>